What about like nutrition? For some reason, like if I were to say, if you have a thyroid problem, there's going to be certain foods that will be helpful and unique to you. And everyone will be like, that makes sense. The moment I say sleep apnea, no, 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 there is no, no that's impossible. Like, I, I, I don't know what the mental break is. When you have sleep apnea, you're not sleeping very well. Not only your body cannot reset and refresh, it's also accumulating a massive amount of damage at night. As a result, instead of being able to rely on your mitochondria for fat burning, now like you're basically like an obligate sugar burner, not only because of the mitochondrial damage, but also you're in this like constant fight or flight. Okay, it is just like nervous system overdrive all the time. So you become this like constant, constant sugar burner. So you need to adjust the macronutrients in a way to account for that. Because if you just eat carbs all the time, you may feel like somewhat good before a meal, after a meal, but then you're gonna be like on the, the roller coaster whoop-de-doo and gaining weight and all the way. 